My name is Mututu Zimogast. Well, I'm playing with Kulega. Okay, so we have just witnessed a, a very great scene there on the on the sets, and that was the best scene. So we just want to find out what goes into the preparation for such a scene, emotionally and and physically. The preparation, it's it's something that uh, I wouldn't say uh, people prepare if uh, they've got a calling. Yes. And uh, I know I'll be sounding very. Uh, Boastful about it, but the thing is, it's true. Uh, if you are, you are being called to do something, and which is a calling from from above, yes. then you, you talk to the person that you said to you, come in. Yeah. Then they do the things. Then you become an instrument, actually. But I think it's a good thing as an actor, obviously, to prepare yeah. by reading your lines and understanding the story, and all that. Definitely. But there are other things that you cannot prepare because this thing for me is like preaching. In church, they will open a verse in the Bible. Yeah. Then I'll hear you preach in a different way. Then when I come in, I'll preach it in my way. But then whatever that I've rehearsed while I was sitting there watching you, I won't say it when I get there. If that thing is real, if it's a real calling. Yeah. So for me, if you can ask me what did I do, I can't even tell you. I don't want to lie. Okay. Yeah. Yes. So if I prepared, maybe I would. Say so, yeah, this is what I did. Yeah, uh, the I was you. sitting there. Then uh, I made, I aligned my things. And yeah. No, I didn't do anything like that. But the thing is, when something is in you, yeah, it's in you, Definitely. and you cannot change it. Yeah, yeah. So it goes on to it surely comes naturally. Yes. Okay. I see. Yes. But then I see that that was an emotional scene. Mm. So does it affect you emotionally? Maybe after just taking the scene, or you just carry on like before how you were before the scene uh it depends how much you've pushed yourself okay for me i don't know other actors but then there's some other actors who will be in that kind of a scene and they won't be able to come back immediately but then because we say we are acting yes. so we need to be able to control our emotions okay. and i think that's for me a good actor will be able to do that okay. so yeah for me it's it's easy, even though, because you know, when I come out of such scene, I feel like I was praying, and a deep, deep, deep prayer, yeah. and I feel so, so relaxed, and I feel like there are things that have moved on my shoulders. So for me, that's why I'm saying I'm, I'm emphasizing on this thing of saying this is a calling. So okay. we 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 do not take it for granted as actors, such yeah. scenes or whatever that we'll be doing at that particular time. But the thing is, uh, for me. Uh, I feel so good. I don't want to lie. I feel. I, I think you, you. You always have a void as yeah. an actor that you. You wanna close a, a certain void inside of you. And obviously, if I would say I'm a Christian, then I would go. I need to go and pray. Yeah. If I'm a traditional man, I need to go and pray. Yeah. So <laughs> what, what what I'm saying is, if I, I do such things, mm -hmm. my king, uh, I, I become on some kind of a trance yeah yeah but then I, a trance that i would be able to control oh yeah if i'm done with the scene they said cut them it must cut yeah, as well with it. Yeah. yeah okay okay so because the issue is that i thought maybe it becomes a burden emotional when you're dealing with such things maybe because when we look at it it looks very real mm -hmm. and for for a person to just move away from such a scene emotionally i thought maybe it, it takes so much uh, to do such, but uh, as you're saying that yeah, for I you, think it's for other actors, for others, yeah, so it depends actors, on it. Does, it does, okay. but well, I'm full no good to meet him. You try, okay, yeah. Uh, I'm not that actor, or try, lie, okay, yeah. Uh, it's very hard for me. I'm used to a space, so I'm, even now, when I go in front of a camera, but I yo, I vibrate in me because. Yeah. Yeah, there's that nerve that says, do good, do good. If yeah. you don't do good, you embarrass yourself. So I always, I'm always nervous. Oh yeah. But then I hide it. But then because it's it's helping me to do good. Yeah. yeah. So, so yeah. So for every scene, it's all about you. Give it your all. Does it matter whether you've been taking uh, scenes back then? Does it matter? Every new scene for you, you give it your all. Yes, you have to. You have to. I think all the actors are. They do that. Yeah. Because you've got such a bunch of great actors in the industry, mm -hmm. so 
they do that. But then the method of of approaching everything that we are doing is not the same. Yeah. Some other actors they pray, some they go to their corner. So we've got different type of people uh, when it comes to these things. So for me, I always say to actors yeah. when I do these small master classes, yeah. I say, if you want to do this thing, yeah. don't put that name acting in your head. Okay. Just say, I do. So you deliver naturally. Then. Yes, in that way, you push yourself to to another level, and all the time. You need to know when you're doing a show, you're auditioning for another show that you don't know. Oh yeah. Because you don't know who will be watching that thing. And yeah. when they're watching that thing, they think, wow, that's why I can invest my money. They call the kinds of you and say, hey, guys, come in. Can you see that guy, this guy? I think we can invest the money. Oh yeah, they watch your performance. Then they start writing just for you because they saw you there. Also, they can maybe come out with a new storyline. Yeah, because they saw you, yeah. you can you can pull it. You've got range. Yeah. So they can pull it in and say, I've "Got a job for you." So you need to know whatever you are doing. Mm. I, I mean, I mean any job. Yeah. When you're doing that kind of job or whatever job that you're doing, know there's a person who's watching you yeah. all the time. They're thinking, "We can use that guy." So you are auditioning all the time. Definitely. When you're doing, you're auditioning. Yeah. So you need to treat. Your first day of shooting and your last day of shooting, like the audition that you did. Yeah, so you give you the same level. Yeah. Okay. So you need to maintain. No, oh, that's good. Yeah. Oh, no, thank you so much. I just wanted to find out more on that. Thank you. The, the scene was very uh, good performance and the delivery was amazing. Thank you. Uh, uh, I think I'll upgrade more. <laughs> yeah. Yeah, you know, we are not good actors, but then we're as good as your last performance or your last job. But I think I'll upgrade. No, thank you so much. Yes, Mikey. Thank you.